Hey guys, it's Mallory here. Welcome back to my channel. Today I am going on a solo trip to the zoo with my two under two. So solo trip and the fact that I am the only adult. Um, I just got both kids ready. We really need to head out the door because our zoo actually has um, like reserve times ever since covid stuff um and they've just kept that so we do have a membership so we i try to go a lot with them i've gone once before with just me and them and it went really well but i'm trying in the morning before asher's nap so i'm afraid he's gonna fall asleep on the way back but i just want to risk it see how it goes try that out because in the afternoon sometimes he sleeps so late that we really don't have time to go and i don't want to wake him up from his nap just to go to the zoo and I don't want to be back later than his dad is home. So I'm like, okay, what do I do, what do I do? But I'm gonna try going to the zoo this yeah. morning. So I'm gonna to attempt to go with my 15 month old Asher and two month old River. River is sporting this little Winnie the Pooh matching set that comes with this bow. We're in the car all loaded up and now the decision is do I get coffee even though it will make us a little bit late to the zoo I was trying to be like perfectly on time for our reservation because we're gonna have to leave like we're not gonna be there very long because of Asher's nap we need to get back so my water bottle is just going all over the place I feel like mentally um, I need a coffee some kind of pick-me-up so I'm gonna do that regardless of being a little bit late um, and it's just gonna be the way it is because it is tough getting two kids out of the house so here we are a little bit late it is 8 56 takes a while to get there like around 30 minutes and our reservations for 9 30 so who knows we could still be on time if I um, drive really well Mallory. Awesome. What can I get started for you this morning, Valerie? Can I please have a 16 ounce iced caramel latte with half of the pumps? Um, that's all, but could I also have an ice water, please? Of course there was a line, so the kids are breaking down, but we're next. Good morning. Good morning. How are you doing? Good. How are you? No, that's okay. All Thanks, right. Bill. Have a good, good day. Drink for you. Have a great day. Asher fell asleep on the way here, but he just woke up when we got here. Hi. He was waving to me earlier. Um, hopefully, River stays asleep. We'll see. We made it and our first stop is the bathroom for me. Asher is wearing this really cute big brother outfit that I ordered on Amazon before River was born. And hopefully she's gonna be going back to sleep soon. I think she's falling back asleep, but this is our double stroller. Love it, it's from Evenflow. And these can all like move around. It can face that way, that way, blah, blah, blah. What do you think about the guinea pigs, Bim? Wow. Do you want to go see the real hippos? What do you think about the monkey? No smiles for the monkey? Can you wave to the monkey? Say hi. Asher, say hi to the monkey. Say hi. Good job. You 
You gonna say hi? Say hi, Asher. What is he doing? So far, this has actually been like one of the best little zoo experiences. We've seen lots of animals. They were like up close or moving around. The penguins are so cool. Asher wanted to like get out and pet them so I couldn't take him out of the stroller. I don't know what he would have done. But um, I actually went, like usually I go around the zoo in a certain loop, if you know what I mean. Like I go to the giraffes first and go around. But this time I went the opposite way and I'm really glad I did because so far it's been really good and it's not too crowded in like as I go to each spot. But Asher's just cruising along here. This is good walking practice, watching the monkey. Yeah, are we having a good morning? Whoa, go get him. There's actually a baby hippo at our zoo. Do you see the warthog? This zoo has so many hills because we're on a mountain. So I'm walking up a hill, pushing the stroller. Oof, it's a workout. Our zoo has the spot where you can actually pet wallabies. So there's one right there, it's hard to see, but they're like hopping around, they're so cool. Asher has pet them before, but it's kind of busy today. Are you holding on to a baby elephant? Wow, you smiling? What is it? Here's a good big brother shirt view. Yeah, you're a big brother. I have to wake River up to feed her, so I've got Asher set up where he can see the giraffes. I'm gonna need to change her diaper, and he's gonna eat a snack. But he has a good view of the giraffes from here. This is what taking two under two at the zoo looks like. I've got River nursing, Asher's eating a snack, we're watching the giraffe. And the lighting's terrible, but it's kind of hot under here. I've got to nurse her, and then we got to head home, and we'll see how his nap goes, because he'll probably fall asleep in the car. Hi, River. Hi. You got a fan on? Hi, sweet girl. Are you finishing your snack? Okay, we made it back to the car. I just changed his diaper. She has eaten and I changed her diaper. She's got a little fan on her right now. I turned the AC on in the car, so we're getting ready. He's finishing eating a snack, so I'm gonna wipe his face. We're gonna go home. So we should be home a little after 12, which is Asher's nap time, so hopefully it all works out where he just sleeps at home. Um, so far he's awake. I have lots of little toys and things to give him to entertain him, but River is upset this whole time, so I'm having to like reach back and hold the pacifier in her mouth. Just put Asher down for his nap. He did stay awake in the car, so that was great. He was a little fussy, but I just kept giving him toys and things. River fell asleep for like a second in the car and then woke up before we got home. So the two kids struggle, or two kid juggle is a struggle. It can be really hard because she, I brought her in to his room to put him to sleep. She started crying, so then I'm like, okay, quick, sing to him, put him to bed. Luckily, he's really great with naps, so that helps. Oh, she's smiling at me while I'm talking. Poor girl has been in her car seat for a while, so I'm gonna take her out, hang out for a little, and then put her down for a nap. Okay, both babies are down napping now, so I'm just gonna enjoy this free time. I need to eat lunch. I'll probably like edit or watch TV or whatever, but that is what 
a day going to the zoo with 202 looks like for me. I'm really glad we went in the morning. I'm glad Asher stayed awake on the way home so he's able to have a good nap here in his bed. Hopefully he has a long nap, we'll see. But uh, thank you so much for watching. Definitely make sure to subscribe if you haven't already. I post lots of mom content, videos, lots of day in the life vlogs. Let me know if you have any video requests and I will see you next time.